Welcome to this video where we will be explaining the difference between etiolation and deetiolation of plants using three different plant varieties in the first part. And in the second part, the role of HY5 in deetiolated plants analysis in strand NGS. Etiolation is a process in flowering plants grown in partial or complete absence of light. Deetiolation is a series of physiological and biochemical changes a plant shoot undergoes in response to sunlight. Let's understand some of the major changes that occur during etiolation. Once we sow the seeds under dark condition, the seed starts germinating and there will be development of short root, elongation of stems, weakening of stems and leaves, longer internodes, hence fewer leaves, chlorosis, a pale yellowish white coloration. Apical hook and unexpanded leaves was seen. Now let's understand some of the major changes that occur during deetiolation. Once we sow the seeds under light condition. After few days there will be development of long root. Elongation rate of the stem slows. Opening of the apical hook. Leaves expands and stimulation of synthesis of anthocyanin. The shoot produces chlorophyll. In short, it begins to resemble a typical plant. Crassula ovita. Crassula ovita are succulent plant need sufficient sunlight in order to maintain compact growth. This grassla plant has stretched out quickly in search of sunlight. The leaves are so spaced and contain thin stems. Sometimes the leaves become smaller than usually. Here succulent plant is completely curved, one of the first sign where the plant is not getting enough sunlight and is started bending toward the bright source. The sad part is once they elongate on matter how much you provide sunlight, you cannot revert it back. And the good news is the pale yellow color can be replaced by green color by exposing them to sunlight. Next is aloe vera plant. As we all know this plant is extensively used by cosmetic, pharmaceutical, and food industries. The plants are suitable for indoor growth, as long as they are kept in the sunlight. Here is an example where one plant is exposed to 6 to 8 hours of direct sunlight which is rich green in color and other plant is grown with absolutely no light. Therefore they cannot produce chlorophyll and they will lose their green color and eventually die. Third plant is Vinca rosio. Welcome to our garden, where we have grown the Vinca rosio plant under dark and light condition. Without sunlight our plant looks dull, we can see longer internodes. Leaves turned pale yellowish white color. Weakening of cell walls in leaves and stem was seen. The stem is stretched out quickly in search of sunlight. Now let's see how Vinca rosia is grown under sunlight. Few minutes before it was drizzling here due to which we can see water droplets on leaves. The leaves are rich green in color. There are many axillary bud and lateral bud are fund. Not only that beautiful Vinca rosia flowers are also grown, looks like that plant is happily grown with the sunlight. Let's move on to the analysis part, the role of HY5 and deetiolated plants analysis in strand NGS. The analysis was done using data from this paper. These are the samples and different condition used to create experiment grouping information. This picture shows how the mutated plant groupings from the paper and their lighting conditions has been added as experimental groups. Now we can visualize the gene expression of all genes in all samples by various plots. Here comes the scatter plot between two samples, dark exposed and light exposed plant with HY5 VP16. Box whisker plot of sample. And. Profile plot. Differential expression was analyzed by ANOVA. All the conditions are compared to HY5 mutant. 6561 genes were found to be differentially expressed. 
a PCA and hierarchical clustering were done based on the genes on the plants. Exposed to light. Here we are showing PCA plot. Next hierarchical clustering of samples. Go analysis and the top Go processes identified are shown in this table. Find our bog link in the description below to get the details on these experimental images such as the parameters used, number of genes expressed etc. For further queries and to try the 20 days free trial license contact support at strandngs.com.